Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryden Matolo and we are here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, this video is all about on how to install the Tifa Lockhart Final Fantasy 7 add-on pad inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always, make sure you download and install all of the requirements that's inside my description below. Once you guys have finished installing your requirements, then all you gotta do is download the mod. I will leave this mod inside my description below so you guys can download it. Once you have completed that process, then we're going to get straight into it. All you guys gotta do is open up your open IV. And then now uh, wait for a few seconds. Then go to Grand Theft Auto V Windows. And then once you guys have completed that, then all you guys gotta do next is go to your edit mode up top here. Select yes. Go to your mods folder, go to update, go to time 64, go to DLC packs, go to add on pins, go to DLC.RPF, go to pins.RPF, and now we are going to install our pad. I have already got one pad in there, so I'm going to install the next one. Open up your Tifa extract folder. Now in that folder there will be a few things in here. So all you guys gotta do is go to Tifa Lockhart folder and there'll be four files in there. Just select all the files that's inside that folder and then drag it inside your open IV. Go back to your extract folder, then that's just select one file and then drag it onto your desktop. Now exit out of your extract folder, but before you do exit out of your extract folder, just go to your output guide, double click, and just minimize that for now, and then exit out of your extract folder. Then now go to edit mode, go to GTA V, exit out of your open IV, go straight to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click, and open file location. Now inside here you must have your add-on page too. So all you guys gotta do next okay is right click and run as administrator. Now once this application pops up all you guys gotta do next okay is go to your file that you have saved on your desktop right click and rename that file and then now go and right click again and then copy the name. Go back to your PEDS drop down menu and then now just add a new PED. And then paste your, your name right there guys. And then go down to your PED type and it's a female and go to is string, false. Then add a PED. Go back to your application and click on rebuild. Select OK, exit out of your application, right click, refresh your game folder, exit out of your game folder, delete that file, it, then now all you guys got to do next okay, is just refresh your desktop and I'll see you guys in the game. And we are here as Franklin, so what we are going to do okay, is that we are going to go and change our pad okay so to open up your paired menu is your owl key now all you guys got to do is go to your add-on pads and then go to tifa right down the bottom and then there you go now as you guys can see it's a bit different it's only because that's why i said that you must go to that guide so i'll show you guys the guide now this is the guide over here you must use menu so yeah, we gotta go to head, hair, torso, and legs. 
So we're gonna use Mino. So go to F8 and go to play option, go to wardrobe, and then go to your front view so you can see the whole view. Now go to over here over to the head. Now with head it will bring the like um like the earrings. So can you see the earrings? So it will give the earrings and the hair, it will change the hairstyle. But unfortunately guys, it's only black. There's no other color. So it's only black. Uh, so I'm gonna change the hairstyle to this one over here. Torso, there's only two outfits, okay? There's only two main outfits, so it's just this one and that one over here. So those are the two main outfits. But you can change the color to and etc. So yeah, you can change it if you want to. Uh, even with this one over here, you can change it down. Uh, so yeah, but I'm going to leave it as, what do I know? I'm going to leave it as uh, this one over here. And down over there. Ah, oh, nah. This one over here. Uh, so, the legs over here is with... The legs is for the gloves. You can take it off if you want to. Or put it on. You can change the style of the gloves. And colour and etc. See? So, yeah. You can change it if you want to. It's totally up to you. And then that's all you guys got to do. And then now exit out of there. You can save your... Head, just go to outfits and then now uh, save outfit to file and then that's it and then now uh, it will save over here now that's how you guys install the Tifa from Final Fantasy 7 so this is pretty cool guys I really like this um, pad so I hope you guys do enjoy the mod and welcome back guys uh, I know it is short but it is an easy mod to install but if you guys do get stuck installing this mod then please let me know in the comments and i'll be more than welcome to help you guys out and if you guys still get stuck installing other mods then i'll be more than welcome to help you guys out so with that all said guys i hope you guys do enjoy this video if you guys did then smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content i will try and upload more and more videos but it's just that um, no one is requesting more videos, so I don't know if anybody needs help or etc. Don't forget that this channel is more for helping people. If you need help, then just let me know in the comments and I will be contacting you soon once I get a notification, okay guys? So with that all said, I hope you guys do enjoy the video. If you guys like the video, smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thanks for watching. Peace. And I'm out.